What's up everybody, I'm Ruby Juice, and today I wanted to do something a little bit different and spotlight a new feature that has come to the FSN. So this feature was just released and it is equipment dealerships. So Hans has built an entire function into the FSN website with equipment dealerships run by actual players. In order to open one of these, you need to sponsor the FSN for a certain amount and you can open a dealership. Now there are only a certain number of dealership spots. So you can't just come in and expect to open one, but if there's an open spot for a dealership, then you can't. So basically what this lets you do is on the dealer side, you have two main brands, and those are brands that you get special factory pricing on. And then you have other brands, you can get whatever equipment you want and sell it at your dealership, but you have to purchase it on your dealership line of credit, and then you sell it to other players. And so what this means for the rest of us as sort of normal players, is we've got a selection of dealers that we can go to and we can look at their inventory. They actually have a physical inventory, so they don't have access to all the equipment in the game at the drop of a hat. But we can go to these different dealers and we can look at the equipment they've got and they have better prices than you can get just buying it from the store in-game like you would in any other save. So from the home page to get there, you go to interactions and dealerships and you come to this landing page where you have the different dealerships lined up across the top and their main two brands listed underneath them. So we've got dealers that specialize in John Deere New Holland, John Deere and Case, Valtra and Case, John Deere and Vaterstadt, John Deere and New Holland, and Fent and Class. So those main brands will tell you what those dealerships will have most of in their inventory and also what they'll probably have the best prices on. So if I go over to Swedish Agro, because I'm a fan of the Fents, Eventually, once you click on that, there will be probably options for used equipment and trade-ins, but for now, we're just looking at new equipment. And so they've got a variety of different things in their inventory. And this is changing all the time. So as players buy these things, they'll disappear. That player who's running the dealership will have to purchase new things to add to their inventory. So they've got some weights here. They've got a bucket. They've got some tractors and forestry equipment. And these are selling for less than you would pay in the game. So for instance, this Fent 900, when I bought it brand new, I believe it was $272,000 in the in-game store. So here I could buy it for $260,000. Now you'll still have to customize it with the options that you want in the shop once you buy it. So you're getting the base model, essentially. You do have the option to add GPS. You see here, adding GPS is cheaper as well. So if you buy it from the in-game store, it's going to cost you $15,000 to add GPS here, $12,500. So you can scroll through the inventory. You can check out different dealerships and see what they've got. So these ones, John Deere and Case. But they also sell other things like the Wilson Pace Setter, Elmer's Hallmaster. So all around, this is just a super cool way to go about buying new equipment for your farm. You can negotiate with these people, so you can find them in Discord. You could message them and try and work out a better price, or maybe if you're buying several tractors, then they'll give you a really great deal. There's definitely a lot of possibilities with this in terms of trying to negotiate. Maybe, you know, have them throw in GPS on something or add a weight for free or something like that. So... There's a lot of really cool things you can do with this. And so once you go in and if you were to purchase something, so say I wanted to buy myself a 6M and I purchased it, the money would be subtracted from my web account. So you need to have the money in your in-game account up here. And once you make that purchase, it puts in an order or ticket for the staff to place that item at the shop on your server. So for me, that's server 19 and they'll place it there at the shop under your farm within 24 to 72 hours, and it will automatically be registered to your account. And like I said, in the future, there are plans to bring in the ability to trade in your existing equipment, and with that, then those dealers will also be able to turn around and sell that used equipment to other players. So this is going to create a whole other sort of dealership meta world for you to buy equipment trade in your equipment, buy used equipment, all kinds of options. This is just an absolutely incredible job by Hans adding yet another feature to the FSN. And I just wanted to make a quick video 
to give it the spotlight that I think it deserves, and also talk about some of the other cool things that will be coming to it in the future. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video, and get out there and buy some equipment.